Welcome everybody. It's been a long time since I've been recording some of these videos and um, well, I guess I'm sorry for it. It's just been, my life's been so, so busy in the last couple of years. Um, first things first, you can probably see I'm in a new place. I moved to a new house. So that was a big deal last year. And also at work, I've been extremely busy traveling a lot and not a lot of time to do any of these videos. Um, fortunately, I've managed to squeeze in uh, my busy times some time to ride. And so I've been riding my bike as much as possible. But um, this video today is about the new bike. So I got a new bike. Yes, I did. I ordered like in March and two days ago, the dealer finally called. It says it's here and it's going to be ready to pick up on Thursday. Today is Sunday. So I still have to wait a couple of days. I haven't seen it yet. It's not in this video, so I'm sorry for that. But if you've been following my Facebook page, you know I've posted there back when I ordered it. I posted the bike I've ordered, which is none other than a BMW GS. Nah, damn it. I was, <laughs> I was in Ireland recently uh, riding and the amount of GSs you see on those roads is absolutely amazing come on people can't you ride something else it's not the only bike in the world it's it's incredible anyway i've ordered another tracer this time the gt because it has a bunch of bunch of upgrades and i'll be doing a video uh, detailing the differences between my 15 gt and this or my 15 tracer and this 2018 gt tracer version uh, but the number one reason I ordered it was the cruise control. I've, I've, uh, I knew it was coming. Uh, the 15 Tracer has the module on the left hand side where you can select, you know, honk and all those things. It has the place there for the cruise control button. So it clearly was coming one of these days. And I have this thing when I'm riding for long hours, I get a tingling hand. So I've been using a contraption that kind of holds the, the um, throttle in place. It kind of keeps the speed steady, but then when you go up a hill, it, uh, it slows down. When you go down, it speeds up. It's a bit wonky. Um, so a cruise control is really ideal for me because I can rest my right hand. It's not like I'm going to ride, you know, uh, no, I'm going to keep holding the bike, but then I can, I can rest the hand and, and, and be, be more comfortable in the end. It's also a safety issue because if my hand is tingling, it's always harder to break and to react. So I really want to get rid of that. So that was the number one reason, but there's a bunch of other things on the bike that, that I like and that are improvements over my 15 model. So like I said, that's going to be in another video. Uh, and this video was just to give you a quick update um, on where I am and things like that. So. I, there's not much more than I can say besides, you know, I'm in a new house still in the Netherlands. Uh, I've been riding around this year. I did Ireland uh, for which I'm editing the video, so it will come soon. Um, last year I did Australia. You saw that video. Early next year uh, I'm going to South America from uh, Santiago de Chile all the way down to Ushuaia to the very bottom top tip. I'm not sure if I'm doing a cruise to go from uh, there to Antarctica and back without a bike, just just myself as a tourist. It's 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 really amazing uh, um, trip, but it's also very expensive to do that cruise on top of the motorcycle riding. So I'm I haven't decided yet if I'm going or not. So keep following uh, the channel because I'm going to upload a bunch of videos about the new tracer as soon as I get it I'm going to compare with this one and right now I'm in my garage getting ready to record a few videos of long-term review of things that I've added to the tracer uh, that I'm now going to get rid of because the tracer is going away this one so I want to do a, a long-term review after three years how things have performed what I like what I didn't like uh, and that's the main reason why I'm here today and also to kind of kick off this new season with a new bike and all those things. So stay tuned and good stuff will come.